Good day everyone, my name is Rajan Fox, and welcome to my Let's Play of Skylar and Plux Adventure Clover Island. Let's get into this. In the outskirts of our galaxy, a relic from the ancient progenitor civilization has surfaced. And I fear what could happen if it fell into the wrong hands. Some say heroes aren't born. Heroes are made. I guess cliches exist for a reason, because our hero is just in the making. Bob, how is our test subject doing? Oh, well look who's awake, our little thief. Are you really so stupid as to think you could steal from the great CRT? Heck, I'm not even sure how you're still alive after that gruesome reconstruction. But hey, I'm not complaining. Once your brand new arm's complete, you'll be able to sucker punch people into orbit, baby. Now, if all this sounds a little strange to you, it's probably because I've started removing your memories. I know, I know. A tad extreme, but that's just how I roll. Can't let you keep that pesky free will of yours, can we? <laughs> okay, bye now. Installation complete. This was a rather unfortunate turn of events, although you no longer remember said events. Hmm, stand by. Initialize kinetic weapon system. It would seem that you have a much greater role to play, Skylar. Let's get you out of here. Interesting. Definitely interesting. Now, first things first. Are you able to walk? Oh, I love the character design. Looks beautiful. Yeah, I'm moving. Splendid. You seem to be fit as a fiddle. Now, I am more than a regular arm. Use me to punch through those boxes. Jeez. Wait, how did you get out? I mean, I see you're uh, taking a stroll. Good, you'll need some training before you're of any use to me. Okay. Game runs really smoothly. I like it. Seems very good. Don't bother jumping those containers, though. It's not like you can jump twice in the air or something. <laughs> uh, interesting method of teaching us. Told me she was gravity defying. I'm terribly sorry, sir. <laughs> I should have known. Oh, I love it. Try my other function on this swarm bucket, the spin attack. Ooh. The spin attack also functions as a triple jump while in the air. Ah. You slapped around Dave and Steve. They were useless anyway. You had to give them names, didn't you? Yeah, I feel bad. Poor Dave and Steve. All right, end of the road, you rascal. You can't get through here. Unless we install that grappling thing. I mean this. Shrimp sticks. I blame you, Bob. I blame you. <laughs> you gonna tell me they have names too? Jerry, maybe. <laughs> Step on red buttons to activate all manner of mechanisms. 
stuff over there. Uh, hang on, I get these crates first. I don't know, are there any hidden collectibles in this game? No, I didn't make it. Or should I be looking out for something else? I don't even know what these collectibles do so far. All I know is I want them. Some broken stuff there. See those swing nodes? Use your grappling beam to swing through the air. Bob, what do those things even do? She's getting away. You're forcing my hand here, kitten. Time to wake <laughs> up our little friend. <laughs> do you have a little friend? He ain't so little. End of the line, kitty cats. <laughs> Get her! Ah, dang it, you imbecile. You complete <laughs> I love that computer. Now's your chance, Kyla. Escape. Brace for impact. friend. Greetings, you guys. I'm Plux, and these islands are my home. Alright, so this is Plux. Mi isla es su isla. Delighted to make your acquaintance, Plux. But we have urgent matters to attend to. Skyla, if you wish to regain the memory CRT erased, you must find the progenitor structure called the Siphon. And oh, I think I know what you're talking about. The islanders always jam about that thing. It's some huge, ancient-looking thingamajig, right? That, uh, sounds just like it, I guess. Can you take us there? I know these islands like the back of my wing. Let me show you the way. No, but you're, you're just following me. Now, I know felines don't like getting wet, and your mechanical arm is far too heavy for you to be swimming. So watch out for large bodies of water. Note to self, keep kitty cat out of water. <laughs> oh, I'm surprised she lets them talk to her about her like that. Come down? Yeah. <laughs> Do -do -do -do. Oh, 
Oh, I must say, this is a delightful game so far. Reminds me very much of uh, Ratchet and Clank, actually, but a lot more up my alley rather than that one. I don't know why, but I wasn't particularly a big fan of Clank. No! There we go. You see this checkpoint? I have dropped these all over the island. They are quantum replicators, and should you, to all our dismay, perish, they will relocate you to the last replicator you passed. And I, uh, added confetti as motivational flair. That's Thank you. Nothing. I was just about to say exactly that. I appreciate the thought. <laughs> oh, I have a feeling this game just gets me. <laughs> Little shadowing issue there, but that's okay. Whoa. Wait, is that the elder? What is she doing in a cage? Pluck, is that you? Could you ask your feeling friends to please get rid of these monsters? Don't you worry your blobby little head. <laughs> Nearby that are full of them. Okay. Well, just before I go doing that, let's just uh, have a look around for gems, apparently. Finally found a use for them, at least. <clears throat> well, hold on just a sweet sec. We're on it. We just gotta. Hey, Skylar, what are we doing? Collecting gems. <laughs> Oh, loving the music. Very nice. Just hang on your royalness, I'll be there soon. Oh, that's different. <laughs> Toxic. Not going to try that. And we'll leave the rest of that way. Alrighty, so let's head up this way. Do -do 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 -do. I have a feeling that's leading off to another level or so. So for now.
this doesn't seem to go anywhere. Alright, let's go release the queen. I'm sure we got enough now. Glowy plant over there. Someone missed. Alrighty, oh, some more here. Gutches. Okay. I need a 300. Oh, thank you, young one. And thank you, two plus. Hey, don't sweat it. But what in the name of funk is going on? A terrible calamity has struck our island. And he calls himself the CRT. His greedy attempt to deconstruct the siphon broke it apart, and I can feel the life force of this moon seeping away. It's an ancient progenitor mechanism powered by three fuses. As the CRT stole one of them, the other two returned to their original places of creation. On the highest point of the island. In the seed lost in time. And the stolen one is kept in a fortress of steel. He has imprisoned my people, the Loar, trying to extort us into revealing the fuse's locations. Oh, please, if you find any of my children, break open their cages just like mine. And for the trouble, I will increase your health. So Ooh. if you ever feel weak and beat down, remember to come and talk to me. That sure seems like a tall order. I'm sure you'll do fine, Skylar. Pleasure meeting you. Plux, I know you haven't embraced Clover Island as your home, and I understand that. But it needs you now more than ever. What? Me? You know this island, so you must guide Skylar on her journey. I guess I know my way around. Sure, if you say so, jelly beans. Very good, my friends. <laughs> and Skylar, let Clover Mountain be a trial of your courage. Best of luck to you both. All right, let's okay. go on adventure. Open five cages in order to increase health. We'll just go on for a bit further. Soaring around this place for years, finding that fuse should be a piece of cake. Let's not be away for too long. I'm waiting for my papa to come and get me. He'll be back any day now. Whoa. Yeah, kind of got that impression, but um, I don't know if that's gonna happen. I get the impression that it's. Not exactly going well for that. Kind of like CRT probably had something to do with him. Going up. Oh, you stuck under there.
Hello. Oh, that's one down. Okay, so I don't talk to them, they just fly off. That's cool. supposed to be. Where are you speaking six, from? But I'm kind of a big deal. People know me. Wait, you never heard of the mighty CRT? You pigeon? Ha! CRT? Does that stand for a cranky robot turd or something? No, it's uh, <laughs> none of your business. Bob and the transmission. Huh, what a sensitive guy. <laughs> oh boy, childish humor. Oh boy. Okay, that did not work out the way I thought it would. What right, back here? Okay. Wrong way. So I need a little more height before I make that jump. Oh, hang on, I think I'm just supposed to jump over. Yeah. Now jump on top. Doesn't seem to be any benefit up there. This time, though. Oh. Uh, give me a moment. There. <laughs> okay. That's two of them down. Oh, camera spaz out there for a moment. Oh, grab hand. Just wondering about that. Makes those easier. But See ya. How to get to ya? I think it's around the other side. Let's go this way and see if it leads there. Ching. Crunchy metal stuff wasn't here before. We'll have to get around it somehow. Can't break any of those. Hey, look! There's a thingamajig straight ahead. Let's see what it is. <laughs> That's you done. That's four of them. <coughs> Three of them. Three. Okay. Haven't been keeping track properly. Oh, do do. else? Yes.
<laughs> oh, that felt good to do. Anything hidden in there? No? Okay. Set back up and do this. Ooh. You found the jet pack. It allows you to hover through the air, rocket jump to high places, and rocket roll over your enemies. Remember, keep an eye on your energy meter. All right, cool. Once a thief. Always a thief. Ain't that the truth, huh, pussycat? Well, fine. It's just a prototype anyway. Probably just gonna break it like you do everything else. And who's that talking through your arm anyway? Bob? <laughs> Is it supposed to do that? Uh, I'm not entirely sure, sir. Then what am I even paying you for? You're not actually paying me, sir. Oh, right. <laughs> Silly me. Ah. Yeah, so it's got to be charged up fully. Oops. Okay. Climb up that? No. Hello. Camera doesn't seem to like me being up there. Oh, I like it. Jetpack works well. Very nice, ah, very smooth. Keeps the action moving. Continue. Oh yeah, <laughs> smash it all. See something I kind of want to check out. Head back up. Oh, never mind that. Game decided to just drop down on me. Hey, probably not supposed to be here, but anyway. Nope, nothing here. Well, at least I don't take full damage. Oh, what was that? What am I missing? Ah! Whoa! Oh, that is awesome!
no! <laughs> that was not so awesome. There we go. Yay! And I am all out of time for this episode. So, please, like, comment, subscribe, I let me know. this place. It's so soothing and easy on the eyes. <laughs> let me know what you think. The words you're looking for are chaotic and, uh, hideous. No! What's your deal, man? My deal? This pathetic island is my deal, pigeon. As in, I own it. I'll turn this wilderness into something more... Productive. You can't. No? That's exactly what those pesky natives said. And look where they are now. <laughs> ah, anyway, tell me when you and Kitty Cat are done sulking and ready to get to work. Whatever he's got planned, it can't be good. We really do have to do something, don't we? <laughs> Alright. See us. Um. Please, like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think. Um, I'm looking forward to playing some more of this. This has been delightful so far. Really, really nice. But, um, yeah, feel free to let me know if you would like to see more. I'm probably going to do more anyway, but I'd still like to hear everyone's opinions. So, for now, I'm Roger Fox, and as always, stay furry out there. <laughs>